Ever wondered how you can transform ordinary ingredients into extraordinary spheres of flavor? Welcome to the world of molecular gastronomy, an innovative culinary field that marries science with the art of cooking. It all began in the late 20th century, when a few visionary chefs decided to break free from traditional culinary boundaries and experiment with the science behind our food. Molecular gastronomy is not just about creating aesthetically pleasing and delicious dishes, it's about redefining the dining experience, making it interactive and engrossing. Imagine eating an olive that bursts into liquid in your mouth or a cocktail encapsulated in a sphere that pops open with a slight pressure. This is the beauty of molecular gastronomy. It pushes the limits of what's possible in the kitchen, turning chefs into food scientists and diners into willing test subjects in an experiment of taste, texture, and surprise. Molecular gastronomy is truly a game changer. It's where food meets science and magic happens. Now imagine turning your favorite juice into a caviar-like sphere that bursts in your mouth. Sounds like a science fiction movie, right? But it's not, it's spherification. So what's the science behind this culinary wizardry? It all starts with a mixture of sodium alginate and calcium. Sodium alginate, extracted from brown seaweed, reacts with calcium to create a gel-like membrane. This reaction forms a sphere around the liquid, encapsulating it. It's a bit like making a water balloon but on a much smaller, edible scale. This process is known as spherification. And the best part? It can be used with any liquid. You could turn your morning orange juice into tiny, popping orbs of flavor or even transform a rich, velvety chocolate sauce into an elegant dessert garnish. Spherification is a testament to the wonders of science and creativity in the culinary world. So, we've taken a ride through the fascinating world of molecular gastronomy and witnessed the magic of spherification. We've seen how this innovative culinary field marries science with the culinary arts, pushing the boundaries of what's possible in the kitchen. From turning liquids into delicate pearls of flavor to encapsulating sauces in a thin, edible shell, the possibilities with spherification are limited only by the imagination. We've delved deep into the process of spherification, a technique that is as versatile as it is novel. Whether you're looking to create a burst of flavor in a bite-sized morsel, or seeking a unique way to present a traditional dish, spherification offers a new dimension to the dining experience. Molecular gastronomy and techniques like spherification truly prove that cooking is not just an art, but also a science. They allow us to create extraordinary dishes, transforming ordinary ingredients into spheres of flavor. So next time you're in the kitchen, why not add a touch of science to your culinary creations?